Welcome back again guys to my YouTube channel and today I have a service call for this fire alarm detection system. The uh, problem was uh, reported there is no uh, power supply on this unit and we will see what is the problem exactly. This is Taiko. Okay. It's a very, very quick uh, service call. When this happened, uh, uh, where is the light here? Huh? Coming from the Okay, this is the fire detection panel. Yes, Jay. Yeah. How are you? What happened to this? This is uh, uh, power supply. Sometimes not coming. Sometimes coming. There's a power supply for this one. This one. Power supply of this. But the system is okay. Working. System is working. Working. Only the line. The line. You have have the lights. Yeah, it's for you. Oh. Put in your... Now... This is 24 volts. Okay, line also. Yeah, line is okay, all okay. Line is 20. 20 okay problem is this display just try to turn off the power turn off oh ah no 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 yeah. i can turn it off from yeah. here okay oh shit oh. Finish. Oh my God. No problem. 
I have my small screwdriver. My, yeah. 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 And here is my battery. Hmm. No alarm also. Okay. So I have here. Okay, just try to remove this to make it easy. Where is my key? Key! Just double check on this key guys, if it is working or not. in e -ball. Good. Okay. What is it, Bruce? Why, yeah? Uh, hmm? No. Camera? This one? Yeah. I'm making a, a report uh, on my job. No, it's slowly down. It's gone, eh? uh, It's like uh, it's losing the power. Some cut in the cable. The panel also is not working, mm -hmm. eh? You have battery? Yeah, battery, battery. Just, what? you give me a battery. So now uh, I tried to uh, solder all the uh, switches here for these switches because most of the time these switches uh, get damaged because of over push and uh, it comes out here. This is just only the switch here. 
and the few contacts only have I mean the the one that's holding is the uh, shoulder only so I make uh, uh, the soldering again and uh, I try also this LED here if it's working but still but system is working and working fine with this already and you see when I do the on and off of the panel see it is getting on and what happened when you when, when you uh, return back to normal it is fading it seems like uh, the uh, supply cannot hold the uh, standby voltage but this system is working fine so do the test again ka huh? do the test again so we'll do the test again if the system is working fine just turn this on Now, see, it's alarm coming. Okay, mm fire is coming. And uh, it is in zone 1. Okay, just reset it. Okay, now it's working. Uh, just reset. Okay, I heard the relay. The relay now is reset. So, just turn it off. Okay. This is fading. I don't know why. But now it is back to normal. Yeah, now it is fading. It's like the voltage on the standby is uh, on the standby board is uh, fading off I put already the battery but uh, what I will do I will just find new panel on a workshop and uh, I'll try to repair this after so now what I will do is just try to turn this on for a little bit time just for the uh, or uh, whatever uh, purpose so let this lid on then when you turn this off this is like on and off selection so now it is in normal mode in standby mode but supposed to be the power will be getting on what happened is when you turn this on standby mode this is the power is just splitting off slowly slowly it's like uh, discharging the uh, uh, supply on uh, the standby mode so what I will do is I will just try to uh, find the uh, spare parts on the uh, workshop and uh, try to uh, replace this uh, and repair this board okay but this is the system is uh, tested they're working fine okay guys thank you very much for watching my youtube channel and uh, I will just make a follow-up video of this. I will try to repair this in a workshop. I will find first the new panel so I can replace this and bring this to workshop. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Bye.